welcome back to Harry Plays. Today we're going to be playing Sky Factory. We did play it about a year ago, but that world got corrupted and I couldn't grow trees, which was basically the whole point of the series. This series, we're going to do Sky Factory again, and our last Sky Factory video was about a year ago and it got 50 views, which isn't that much. But, compared to my other videos a year ago, which got about 20 to 30 views, so 20 more views a video, which, if it goes the same as these videos, could be good. I'm not ending my other series, but depending on how good this series does, um, I will be continuing this, because unlike normal minecraft sky factory does kind of have an end you you basically get everything done you can't do anything more so let's create a new world we have all these options of stuff but we're going to be playing just normal sky factory we're going to have prestige disabled which we don't really need to worry about it's a bit um, complicated and let's just name it let's let play let's I've, I don't know I can't spell English today let's just name it Harry plays YouTube yeah create new world and if you watched my how to do it last video on you probably didn't because it was quite a while ago but i'll explain as we go in this video i want to at least get maybe a cobblestone generator up so we can get lots of cobblestone but As we load into the world, we start on a dirt tree. So, vein miner is on. So, we go like that. It's a bit laggy. Then, create a crafting table. Place down that. Get some slabs. Whoops. Make a three by three area. Make some sticks. Make a crook. And there we go. We got one dirt sapling, which is really lucky because I think the others fell off the edge. So, if we just go along like this, and make the platform bigger, we now can always catch the saplings. Like that. And then, place down that, and crouch to grow it, or the easier way is to just sprint around it. Break this. Nine saplings. And then we break this. And yeah. So now we make some more slabs. Make some more wood. Go like that. Make two drying racks. Go like that. And put the acorns on. And I'll be back once I have eight of whatever this goes into and done so now we can remove these because for now i don't think we're going to use them for the rest of this episode as you can see i've expanded the island a bit what i'm going to do is go like this across the edges 
so it looks a bit nicer. But I gathered quite a lot of wood, some resin and some acorns and some saplings. So now what we need to do is put a dirt sapling in the middle and surround it with petrified sapling. Now we can use this and get ooh, cobble stone, which is just about your res value, valuable resource in just the normal game. So I'll get that, and then what I'm going to do next is work towards where is it a clay sapling actually we can make that now dirt sapling dirt resin petrified resin clay sapling that's another sapling and then we're going to need a sand sapling which is clay sa gravel saplings in a crusher gravel saplings are made where's gravel gravel are made by petrified acorns in a crusher which is made like this so we put that down there put more in the middle and then we get this one two three four five six seven eight nine so now we've got 11, which now we can put that dirt sapling there, it's petrified, gravel sapling, so that's three more saplings we have, and now we can get that and turn it into a sand sapling, then we can start making our cobblestone generator. So, I have done some stuff, I got a sand sapling and got some sand resin and some sand acorns I also got some chests and I got this crafting station which is cool wait what the chest next to it goes into it oh I did not know that well so I should probably move all this stuff down here so now that's there and I can bring that there and leave it and you can see it on there and it stays on there which is sick I also made this which is just a handheld crafting table and yeah so what I'm going we are going to make is I've bookmarked it is a cobblestone generator um it makes one cobblestone every 40 ticks which is quite a lot of cobblestone um and it requires six cobblestone one lava bucket one water bucket and one glass and you're probably wondering how am i going to get the water and lava buckets well you can make clay buckets but that means i need a furnace so i need quick maths Fourteen cobblestone, which right now we have got. In total, we have got three cobblestone. Not as bad as I thought, but we need five more to make a furnace. And our food source right now is dirt acorns, which isn't the best, but I'm going to grind some petrified saplings. I have got all the cobblestone. It didn't take that long, to be honest. So now what we need to do is just get a furnace, place it down. And we need to get clay. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. 
and then that's all what we need we turn those clay into unfired clay buckets then we go in here and smelt these clay buckets in the meantime we go here and make a piece of sand and that sand is used for the glass in the middle and we collect this get the sand and then we make a cauldron which we can make a wooden cauldron we get our torch put that there we're going to need a teeny bit more cobblestone but what we do now is we need to be fast otherwise it'll start to burn one two three four. there we go and then what we do is we get our crushing tub back out or there get our sap get some saplings and then we place it down and just crush it until that number at the top there is 1000 collect that and break it because we don't need it then what we do is now we just need to gather four more cobblestone and then we put all those materials together and we make a cobblestone generator so i'll be back once i've got four cobblestone and done so what i'm going to do first is i'm going to move all of this to the top and do that let's grab our petrified sapling not saplings acorns out and then what we do is we go we need to grab these parts and then we go one two three four one two three four five one cobblestone so now we go like that place that like that and we've got a cobblestone generator so we get one bucket back mind that block out place cobblestone generator and cobblestone will slowly start to come through and yeah now we've done our goal for today so next episode we are going to work on our food because right now what i am need to, needing to do is let's just mine that out i'll do some work around the place while i'm doing it is make a apple sapling so we can get food and that food we can eat as you do so you I, instead of eating acorns and also we are going to be making a what is it called an iron sapling an apple sapling is made from apple seeds which in the question tub is apple so we're going to need an oak sapling uh, let's just do saplings so i can show you so we're going to need an oak sapling which is a dirt sapling and water which you could technically do now we could technically do it now yeah let's do it now um <laughs> And we're going to get an iron sapling next episode. So let's 
pin that iron sapling and let's pin the apple sapling so we know what we're going for and now what we do is get crushing top out, get petrified saplings get the bucket one two three four five six seven eight nine ten pick that up go like that put that in there get a dirt sapling place that in there get an oak sapling and now let's plant that let's take these and then throw them out and let's get this and make another crook and then do that I don't think we got apples that time which is fine go like that store again there we go apple we get our crushing tub back out put that and we go like that so now what we do is we need to make an apple seed which is that and we've done that when planted becomes an apple sapling done that that can't be done like that so what we're going to need to do is make a bone sapling which is made with bone meal which is made with water gravel and water bone meal gravel I don't know if we're gonna have enough one two one two one two one two yeah we're not gonna have enough so what we do is we place down another piece of dirt we will remove this piece eventually get some gravel saplings and we go run around if you just heard a beep i just got sent a message and then one two one two one two one two one 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 go like that wait don't do times two no go like that and then we got a perfect amount to go one two three and then what we do is i think it's a petrified yeah get a bone sapling and then we run around to grow it so we'll go like that and we go like that and then that gives us just enough uh, that's gravel saplings gives us just enough to make a bone block which can be turned into nine bone meal and then we need to eat so grab some dirt acorns run around oh it still needs to be bone milled there we go go like that make another crook and we got some more apple saplings which i don't think dropped an apple that time but if we look oh shit mess another message um which is a 70 percent chance drop in apples so we actually got quite unlucky there but that's in a bonsai plant 
So, with a bonsai plant, a hopping bonsai plant is made with iron. So that's what we're going to make next episode. We can take that apple sapling off our um, task place, I guess. So now we need the iron sapling. But if you just want to know, to put stuff up there, you need to press, you need to hover against it and press A. And to take it off, you press A again. And yeah, so. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video, if you did, like, it's kind of been like a tutorial, but it's also been a video, so if you want to follow this to get started, you can, and if you really enjoyed it, subscribe, if you want to see more, hit that bell, once you subscribe, and yeah guys, if you want to see more of this series, just hit the like button I guess. Or if it gets a decent amount of views, I'll post some more. And bye. Peace, everybody. Roll the outro.